General Malice. Yeah. I don't know if I ever told you, you got a beautiful face, bro. Oh, you know what? You got a beautiful face, too, you know? Oh, you, too. It's like a Mexican stand-up. It is. <laughs> All right. Let's go. All right, everybody. Let's get inside. Something video game related. Oh, we sensor bar. Wii sensor for fourteen ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. Cheese. Gonna pass. Wow, dude! High School Musical. Look at Zac Efron right there. Oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. Ooh. Oh yeah. Well, it's a limited edition. There's no sensors. Really? Yeah. You got the hero power. It just needs the dongle. Where this is going, it's not going to need the dongle. Oh, <laughs> 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 well, that's the that's the uh, rocksmith one. That's an iPad looking thing. Oh, dude, this one's sick. You put your iPad on it. Oh, really? That's what it looks like. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's an iPad. Never seen this one before. Fingers of your bleed for a place later. I think I'm gonna get this one. Oh baby. In good quality. Oh dude. Look at this. Whoa, bro, bro, for both? Yeah. That's a really good deal, bro, for the steel plates. These are like four or $500 a piece. That's actually a really good deal, bro. If, you had, if, 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 I, if I was in my city, I would be buying this all day. Come on, show up. Where is this, Tiny? Oh shoot, let's go check it out. Where is this tiny? Retro City Games. My buddy stuff. Are you filming me again? I'm filming you again, oh, yeah. I feel... love it. I love it too. Yeah.
get for you. Yeah, just so look at this game, Blue Reflections. So open one seventy four ninety nine. I was in half price books about six months ago. I found a sealed copy and an unsealed copy of that game for ten bucks a piece. Wow. <laughs> yeah. All right, everybody. So we have got done with our day hanging out with Tiny and Gabo. We had a great day. We had a stream today. We went shopping at Goodwill, found some DDR dance pads, uh, a guitar. A hell of a great deal, and then a bunch of awesome people came into the stream, supported General Malice, supported Gabo, and then supported Collector Source. And then, dude, we had after sales. People came from the stream yeah. into the freaking shop. They came and hung out, so that was easy, cool, right? Amazing. Happiness. Happiness. Always. Always. But I wanted to say thank you very much to first and foremost thank Gabo you. for being here to have to hang out. Oh, I called, you, I was like, you. come hang out with me while I'm no, there in Vegas. Thank you and thank you. What <laughs> a guy. Tiny, man. We got so much more. We got two more days of adventures. And so Gabo has to depart going back to California, going back to Cali. But you know going what? back, back to Cali, Cali, Cali. Cali. <laughs> but we appreciate you being here. And so don't go anywhere. We got more to come. Two more days of action. All right, everybody. So I'm in Goodwill and I found my first find. Check it out. All right, here we go. First thing we found, got a PlayStation Move controller. This is the PS3 version, but for $1.99, we will definitely take that. All right, everybody. We just finished that pawn shop. Didn't find too much stuff, but we did find about 40 bucks worth of stuff. Miss Nas, we show you what it is. All right, so I always like to look for DVDs in pawn shops. They're usually really good prices. Um, scout for sealed DVDs first. It's a quick way to look um, for money. So I found this School Ties. It's already posted on Amazon. It's about a $10 profit right there. And then I found this one. It's called Silent Fall. It's got John Lithgow. It's an older movie. And uh, this one's already posted, and that's a $20 profit right there, too. Yeah, so that's what you do. Pawn shops are great. Let's see if we can find something else. All right, everybody, it is day three now here in Vegas. Tiny's got us another cool couple of spots we're going to hit. Yep. And Average Dude's going to be showing up here in about an hour. So where are we going inside right now? We're going to save yourself. Oh, let's go. Let's go save. To save us, baby. Off the bat, to the right, we got the right DVDs there. right there from Miss Malice. You see, I bet you know where the games are at. Where are the games at? So we got, all right, all right, everybody. Let's count the resellers. We got one, two, three. Four. And then Tiny makes five. So it looks like Tiny there is five resellers sitting in this area checking product. Woo, slappy world. Like, this is crazy that, you know, how much are all these DVDs? One dollar? No, they're three. So imagine, what would it take to try to get your money back for a Halloween stream? Right? Is it, is three dollars a stream there? That's what, I mean, that's what I'm thinking, right? So it's like, is it, is it fair? Miss Malice. Oh, she's way down at the end. She left. This, this is, oh, she's at the end of the video. She found video games wandering at the end. Really? Yeah. The video game? Mm -hmm. They got kind of sectioned up Halloween. Mm -hmm. So I didn't know if that would be something super interesting to look at. Oh, cool. So now we'll watch the Grandmaster at work. Cha -cha. So usually music you have to be approved for. I understand. So. Alice found a stack, but nothing's coming to fruition. And we and we always say, this is what we like to do. We'll pull a bunch of stuff at once, then check it, and then put it back instead of checking one at a time. Come on, put it on cards. Come on. That's an animal. I wonder if it still works. There we go, a bunch of Sonic stuff. That's what I'm talking about. All right, everybody, we are at our next stop, and guess what, average dude? How we said was gonna show up, showed up. What's up? So we're gonna go inside. He's got a little bit of time. We got a pawn shop. This is Jewelry Super Center, Super Pond. 
We went to one yesterday, so y'all be familiar. Let's go. What'd you find? Actually, yes. <laughs> Straight off the bat. Found something. What did you find? Check it out. All right. Choo! You know Fender bases and stuff like that. And... One Yamaha, two Yamaha, and then a couple of base ones. How are you doing today? Good in yourself. Doing all right, man. Good, good. Let us know if you have any questions, okay? Always, sir, always. Oh, there's the consoles. I didn't even see those over there. See those? She was quick to, huh? You even got more systems over here. As is a hundred bucks. Well, what's wrong with it? Clearly doesn't work. Broken controller? It comes with a broken controller? So check this out. You know what this is? That looks like it's for a PS4? Yes. So I have the headset for it. <laughs> so this is all I need, and I found it. So I'm going to probably purchase it. So, man, we just got quite a few things. Yep. Quite a few things, and we can go over that here later on in the, when we get back to the house. Average Juice got a suggestion where are we going to go? So, I recommend a place. It's uh, First Cash over at Washington and Buffalo area. The last time I was there, I think I saw, like, a bunch of vintage stuff. Uh, they also have consoles, games, and, like, little handhelds, too, like Game Boy Advance, Game Boys. I don't know what their stock looks like now, but I would recommend going to that. Well, that sounds like what's where we're going next. Thank you very much, Average Dude, for hanging out with us, man, today. And let's go ahead and get on to the next part. We got an Average Dude, we got a Tiny and a Miss Malice, and guess what? We're at the Jewelry Center, Cash America, Super Pond. Let's go inside. Cha -da -da. Looks like it. <laughs> About two hundred for the uh, for the. Yeah. What's up? Huh? What needs to go and whatnot? Oh shoot! What? Why does it say backyard brakes on it? All right, hold on. I think they lost something. All right, let me check that out. All right, man, look at this. Average dude finding something cool. Well, I'm kind of interested in this because this is pretty badass. These portable TVs, usually when you find these, the That's antennas cool. are broken off, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. So, I mean, what's cool about this, too, is you can hook up an NES to it and just like to sit there in your office, you know, desk or whatever, and just play a little Mario. It's got a speaker, too. Yeah. So you got sound. And it has AMF in. That's, that's cool. What, that's what this is good for. So, kind of curious to say that it's $30. Uh, assuming that I could, it powers up or anything. Hey, hold on a second. Turn it back around. Does it have battery? Yeah, this is a battery. What? Looks like some D's or C's? C's. Yeah. Eight of them. Oof. That would make it pretty heavy. Yeah. But, uh, hey, you get four hours of TV. Yeah. Xbox One X up there. Not a great deal, but not bad. Whoops. Smile, you're on camera. It's on camera. Hot Wheels, crazy. It's in pretty good condition.
Look at this, everybody. Steampunk awesomeness. So we gotta provide our own light, but that is okay. It's an adventure. It's even more cool this way. Battery pack from the Game Gear 65. In box. It's the Thunder Megazord. Alright, we are done with our trip in Vegas. We hung out with Mike and Maddie, collector source in Miss Tiny and Tiny. And we also got to hang out with Average Dude, Brad, which was really fun. And we had a great time. So hopefully, awesome you know, we can do that again. And if you like this type of content, hit that like, subscribe, follow button, keep up everything with the malices. Enjoy the last of this flight home. Here at Southwest Airlines, that's welcome aboard.